flatbed truck. That's the pretty much the only thing that can go all the way down that block. At the end, that's the Passaic River. We've got multiple issues here in Patterson. The ground is already fully saturated. We have the river that's expected to crest. And of course, we have more rain coming tonight. The sporadic discharge of water from yet another flooded basement on Bergen Street in Patterson, New Jersey, providing a soundtrack of sorts. I've been here almost all my life. Longtime resident Kwashik reluctantly accepting that his street and the neighborhood shouldered by the Passaic River are destined for post storm scenes like this. You can't stop water. Water go where you want to go. Amen. Emergency responders conducted at least two water rescues on this street alone Friday morning. By the afternoon, the water receded enough to allow other residents to evacuate their homes on foot as utility crews went door to door, shutting off the gas. Further down the block, closer to the river, the water is much deeper, the damage more extensive, and it could get worse with more rain in the forecast for late Friday night. What happened to your business? Lost everything. Auto body shop owner Nay Jamie is looking at a total loss. Right now you go over there, the water is coming like, like that. All of his equipment and all of his customers' vehicles still underwater from the most recent rainstorm. I don't got no money, I don't got no water, I don't got nothing. Did you have any warning to get the vehicles out before it rained? Nobody said nothing. Nobody, no coming fire department, nobody coming. It's a trick in the morning. We asked Patterson Mayor Andre Saya what can be done to address neighborhood concerns about chronic flooding. Well, I'd like to say that this is also a federal issue, a state issue, and that we're working with our partners. Last year, we applied for a grant through the Department of Community Affairs. It's to build a flood resiliency wall on McBride Avenue to help us combat the flooding. You know, one of the people that we met here on the block today is one of Mr. Jamie's customers. His Range Rover parked in that auto body shop, now submerged, a total loss. He says he doesn't know what he's going to do. Mayor Saya telling us that the city has two open shelters tonight, 100 beds each. They're ready, and he wants everyone to know that the street closures, closures in Patterson, almost two dozen, that could increase as the rain comes overnight and the river crests on Sunday.